The cash concerns in the emergency department are labeled by color, not by number. So the green zone is for um, what we call acute patients. We also have a blue zone, which is for rapid assessment. We have a yellow zone over here, which is for trauma. And we'll go through these as we do the tour. This is what we call the main communication station. This is where the nurses and doctors will sit and do their work. I know. It's can everyone hear me down there? All you, got, all you people down there, can everyone hear me? This is an important piece again about patient, uh, patient care. This is a dedicated um, ambulance entrance. So this is where all the patients arriving by ambulance will enter. So you're right there, right where the communication station is. And then these four rooms, Y3, Y4, and Y5, are trauma. They're completely fitted out with the latest technology for trauma, it's almost like going to an operating room. These are down here. In this part of the communication station, we have um, you know, a technology that some of the clinical teams work with and don't like the room. I believe there's two negative pressure rooms in the room. Okay. And the stretchers are all, I think they have the, um, you can tell the weight of the patient on the stretchers, they're all, yeah, they're pretty. Yeah. Pretty nice. Yeah. Over here, when something comes up, it all gets sucked in. That's what negative pressure is. These two rooms are the two of our special patients that come in from um, our uh, correctional facilities partners. So these are special, and, and you can see that um, nurses and physicians can document online. The idea is, and then um, you know, people can be watched. So again, really cognizant about patients' privacy, the type of patients we get at Northern Hospital, making sure everyone is going to be at the end of the hallway down here. So compare the space to what you're used to now in our emergency department. Oh. <laughs> it's, 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 it's four or five times bigger. It's really bigger footprint. On the rooms have changed the color. So it's a really good visual identifier. Follow me down to the Blue Zone Communication Station. <laughs> I know it's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So this is this is that encompass the entire emergency department. Now what we didn't go into, there is, you know those triage bays that I showed you, there is a phlebotomy area where if somebody needs either blood work done or an ECG done, you can remove them from the triage area and put them in a separate room again, patient privacy. So this I want to focus on here. This is a light well that was purposefully built to, um, again, engage your senses, make you feel a little bit calmer. This, this is a nice rock garden. That's the main lobby over there. So it gives you a visual of what's happening over there, while you're waiting here. It's beautiful. They haven't got them yet, but they will have. This one. This is two. This is two. This is two. Yes. 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 Oh my goodness. Oh my God. They have shower too. And you can see that um, we have sort of a window that goes almost to the ground. That's again for um, accessibility issues. If somebody comes in in a wheelchair, they can see the full view of what's happening. Wow. 